Yeah. Hello everyone, welcome to Apnagoro channel and this video is all about your NMDC exam 2022 which is scheduled on 24th of April 2022, right? So now how to handle the th syllabus because I saw the syllabus and it is very vast, okay? I am sure that the one who framed the syllabus does not have any single idea about any of the branch, okay? That is for electrical, they want you know, knowledge of AI also, mechatronics also, for mechan mechanical also they want knowledge of various subjects which does not belong to mechanical same for civil same for mining same for qnc and your other branches right so now the question is how to handle such syllabus smartly right so that we can be in merit list because you know that selection will be 100 percent based on your exam only okay and definitely supervisor trust is there but that is qualifying in nature you can qualify easily no need to worry in that but our primary focus is exam right so definitely in this video, I am I will tell you how you can go, okay, your subjects, your everything perfectly and how we can handle and manage this thing, okay. We are engineers, so we, can, we welcome every challenges that we face in our day-to-day -day life or in computer exams, right. So let's start our video. So majorly, your exam is divided in two sections, okay, first section and your second section. In first section, obviously, it is your technical, okay, and second one will be your general. Now the most important thing about NMDC, the pattern is different. Total 100 questions will be there for you, right? Out of which 60 questions are from technical and 40 questions are from general, right? Now see, as you know, the syllabus of technical is very vast, okay? If they suppose put the topics which does not belong to your branch, then definitely that marks which you are losing here in technical part, okay? You should cover in general part also, only. This is most important thing you should understand here, okay? So don't take general part lightly. This 40 marks is important out of 100, right? Two hours you will get. So yes, time is enough for the exam. Don't need to worry here. Definitely how you can utilize this time, okay? Where to invest your time, in which topic you will invest. I will share you in the further videos, okay? The main important thing is that now there is no negative marking, okay? So you will definitely have attempt all the 100 questions, right? And definitely paper is your OMIOS paper. So it is offline exam at particular center, whether you got the centers, it is your offline exam, right? So on OMR sheet, you need to just uh, circle out the things and that's it, okay? So this is a general overview and a basic overview of your NNDC exam. I hope it clears now. Now we will start our discussion first for from non-technical, which is common for all the branches, whether it is mechanical, electrical, civil, GNC, okay, survey, for all branches it is common. And then I will show you branch wise, okay, breakdown of syllabus. In the uh, timestamp also, in the below, you can see your branch wise and thing, everything. Okay, everything you will, you can see in timestamp. Okay, so let's start with our general section first. So in con, basically what we need to study, percentage ratio, LCM, LCM, profit loss discount, okay, number system, SSCI, time and work, boat and stream, pipes and system, average menstruation, time distance, edges, trigonometry, height and distance and geometry. Okay, now see. The level of quant will be basic to or I can say easy to moderate, okay? Easy to moderate level will be there. Now those students who are constantly following our telegram PDF, okay? No need to worry because you already did your preparation at NMDC level, okay? No need to worry. But now those who didn't know about telegram PDF and everything, okay? And they just want to do quant at their best level in this upcoming 10 days, okay? What you can do for you, we have Q box, okay? Okay, so in the comment section, I will give you the link of the Q box. What you need to do, just download our application, go to store section, just click on Newcombs for Q box, okay? Just click on here, go to content. And now here you can see in the here, okay? In count aptitude, just click on here. And you can start the quizzes, okay? So lots of quizzes are there, but you can just all lots of means as possible as you can. It up to you how many you practice. The more you practice, definitely the more you will get confidence in your con section. Those who already have Q box, okay? So Q box plus your Telegram PDF. So combine these two to get maximum marks in your con section, right? Okay. So it is in English and Hindi. So you can see DI is most important because definitely sure shot question you will get from DI. Okay, out of this 40, at least you can expect 2 DI. 2 DI means, uh, one suppose 1 DI have 5 questions, so 10 questions from DI, you can expect. Okay, so DI is most important because, see, based on current pattern, okay, what is currently trending in your technical exams or non-technical exams or any of the technical exams, I am telling you things. So DI will be surely there, okay. 
सो यू शुड प्रैक्टिस दिया है वेरी गुड मैन सो लाइक दिस स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ क्यूब यू कैन सी एंड डिटेल सोल्यूशन आर देयर ओके यू कैन सी एवरी थिंग सो जस्ट प्रैक्टिस द थिंग बिकॉज दिस इज द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग फॉर यूर प्रिपरेशन ओके दैट्स वाई इट इज लाइक बाय ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड थर्टी स्टूडेंट्स ओके सो समरी इज यूर क्यू बॉक्स प्लस टेलीग्राम पी डी एफ जस्ट डू दिस ओनली फॉर द रेस्ट ऑफ द टेन डेज नो नीड टू टच एनी एक्स्ट्रा थिंग इफ यू आर लैगिंग इन सम टॉपिक देन जस्ट रिवाइज रिवाइज एंड अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टू अप्रोच द क्वेश्चन ओके इन कॉन बेसिकली इट डिपेंड्स ऑन योर प्रैक्टिस द मोर यू प्रैक्टिस डेफिनेटली यू यू विल गेट इम्प्रूव ओके सो डेफिनेटली दिस इज ऑल अबाउट यूर कॉन फॉर ऑल द ब्रांचेस द नेक्स्ट यू आर रीजनिंग पार्ट सो वॉट यू डू स्टडी इन रीजनिंग कोडिंग डिकोडिंग क्लासिफिकेशन ओके द नंबर सीरीज नाउ सी द करंट ट्रेंड वॉट इज गोइंग ऑन यू नो कोडिंग डिकोडिंग नंबर सीरीज लॉजिक्स विल विल गेट डिफिकल्ट लिटिल बिट ओके सो लॉस्ट ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स आर फेसिंग डिफिकल्टीज इन एग्जाम हॉल इन दैट पर्टिकुलर टाइम to attempt the questions of coding decoding and number series can you imagine so this is the current trend going on for all the technical exams last whatever exams have happened nil at your hl okay then you have, now it is bdl lots of exams you know obviously i keep track on track of current trend for you guys so that i can guide you in very good manner right so here you need to take care of this thing now those who are solving our telegram pdf from 1 2 3 4 months definitely you don't need to worry because you are solving the quality questions only okay so no need to worry then second cube box those who have cube box again combine it with your telegram pdf whatever telegram pdf you can refer okay current also and the last one month telegram pdf is enough okay those who know don't know about telegram pdf just go to file section of apna government job official telegram channel you will get all the pdfs basically this initiative has started from 1 april 2021 already one year completed and there is definitely surprise there for all the students okay but definitely i will make separate separate video on that the important thing is that special attention on coding decoding and number series sure shot four to five questions you will get from here okay see out of 40 we don't know the breakdown of con gk and reasoning this thing we don't know okay they it's up to them they can put any number of questions there so we should hit all the angles of all the these three subjects okay because obviously in the start only i what i told you that in general we will cover up all the sub marks that we are losing in technical extra subjects okay direction trends blood relation you can do definitely telegram pdf cube box okay again counting figure missing figure paper cutting for for bonding uh, for non verbal reasoning definitely rs agrawal is best if you already do that okay but for other standard our cube box and telegram pdf no need to worry in there okay then you are analytical part statement and conclusion assumption okay then your silox is there Silox short short question from Silox. Okay, DI already told you DI short short question course of action, sitting arrangement circular and your this what linear right then puzzle short short they will give you puzzle yes puzzle will be there okay so I can say two DI whatever current pending is going on okay and one puzzle if you are unlucky okay yes I will tell unlucky then they will also give you two puzzle right so yes definitely I will. Uh, tell you guys how to attempt the paper okay i will make separate video for that no need to worry in that but 2d and 2 puzzle for now we are just uh, for our convenience we are thinking okay and analogy is there definitely from analogy also good questions they are framing but uh, in the telegram pdf for lots of question you solve from analogy coin decoding number series okay see now for coin decoding number series analogy lots of practice is required of months it is not like uh, you will get here confidence or you will get all the logics here in this rest of the 8 to 10 days it is not possible this is not practical okay whatever thing is practical i told you i tell you it is not like i am giving you false motivation or okay obviously not because obviously that doesn't give you result okay so for reasoning also cube box and your telegram pdf whatever practice you can do you just do that okay as possible as can you can okay the last section general awareness right So now in general awareness, basically this part is also there. Part A and part B is there. Okay, that is current affair plus stat GK. So now for NMDC, I don't think okay that they will ask you this. So you can just skip this. If you already studied this part for any of the examination, previous examination, then revise. Okay, again those who already studied this part, that is GS portion for any of the previous exam, just revise. Those who didn't know about this, those who didn't touch this, do not touch it for the rest of the eight to ten days. Obviously, it will not help you. Obviously, okay. Now, full fort focus will be here on your current affairs and static GK part, which is the most important part. Okay. 
Now for this part, we have magazine box. So those who are magazine box, definitely combine it with your Q box. Plus Telegram PDF is must. Okay. So Q box, Telegram PDF, and magazine box. Now you will those who are not following. Okay, and you are new, suppose. So you will tell me that how you can I can manage these three things. Okay. So what I will recommend, just go for your magazine box. One month also version is available. Six month also available. Okay. It is the most powerful. I can say tool for your current affair and static GK part, right? So let me show you this. Okay, so on the same application, this is Magazine Box one month trial. Okay, so this is for one month and this is your six month Magazine Box. So suppose I am going to six month. Here go to content. Okay, current affair magazine. Now most important thing that from which month to which month you should refer for your NMDC. Okay, so at least refer last six month. That is your exam is April na. So full April month. Okay, till your twenty April. Then March will be there, February, January, December, okay. Then you are November, October. So at least from October, November, December, and till your April, okay. October to April, you should refer all the current affairs. Now see the most important thing and the speciality of Magazine Box. How you can use this to get the maximum result in your GK part, right? So see, suppose I click on March month, okay. Click click on English because you are giving exam in English. Those who are giving in Hindi, definitely Hindi is also there, okay. No need to worry in that. Okay. Now suppose you want to study. Okay, here the important dates. Lots of files are there. So important dates. So just I click here. So you can see in a single find you can revise all the important dates of February month. Okay. So this is the speciality of Magazine Box. Basically, you can do quick revision with this. Okay. So just read and revise quickly before your exam. Short, short question. They will ask from important days of month. You can expect this question in your NMDC exam. Okay, out of from October to April, do all the important dates. Okay, with the motto and importance. So I can say theme also. Okay, theme, motto, or importance, and definitely you need to remember day and also everything. Okay. Then second, you are sports category. Definitely you will get question from sport. Okay. Now how to understand the sports? See, if you are reading this news, International Cricket Council will ICC Awards 2021. Okay, winners you can see. So Rachel Lee Flint Trophy for ICC Women's Cricket of the Year, Smriti Mandana. Okay, so they can ask you that Smriti Mandana is associated with in which sports? So answer is cricket, right? So like this also you need to study because definitely they will ask questions from sport anyhow, right? So study like this. It any important extra strategic information also there like Ice Hockey Association of India when it is from April twenty seven nineteen eighty nine. Okay, who is the current president? Dr. Surendra Mohan Bali. So extra information also given to you. Okay, this is the sports cup file. Then the important thing is India to host AFC Women's Football Asian Cup 2022. So this question is asking NSPC. Okay, so all the things are here in magazine box. No need to worry. Just in a single magazine box, you can cover all over India exam. Okay, so this is the most powerful thing. Just you should know how to use that. Okay, that's why I'm telling you these things. See, Lavani artist from Maharashtra wins gold medal at International Folk Art. Festival. Okay, so Maharashtra governor, who is governor of Maharashtra, then capital, who is capital, CM is who. Okay, so all this basic information you should know because from this also, sure, sure, they will ask the question. Then the winners list of Sydney tennis, like this, all the files you need to study from your October to April month. Okay, so again summary, those who are not following Telegram PDF and everything, okay, do not need to follow. Just our magazine box is enough for you. Either one month, six month, it's up to you. Okay, there is no restriction. Because lots of actually what happened, lots of candidates are facing difficulty to purchase six month magazine box. That's why I give them one month, okay, just to cover the recent exam. So magazine box is enough. And those who are following Telegram PDF, your Telegram PDF to just maximize your preparation, okay. Plus Q box if you have Q box, plus your magazine box. These three are enough for you. No need to worry at all, okay, for general awareness. Now see, in general awareness, lots of students will struggle all over India. If you want to beat them, definitely this is the first section we will target. Second will be your quant, and third I can say DI because they specifically mentioned DI. That's why DI is most important thing, right? And last reasoning, and then your technical part. Okay, so like this you will do. Now I will start the discussion of technical part for branch wise technical part. Okay, so in the timestamp you can see your branch. So just go there and you can watch that part. Yes. So now we will discuss our discussion of sixty questions and sixty marks in your NMDC exam. Okay. So see, now full priority will be to your high weighted subjects that they may ask to NMDC exam. On what basis I am telling you high weighted subjects? So 
previous year definitely not does not matter now okay based on current trend what is trend going on from your july to april month exams in technical i can say okay so we'll start discussion in electrical engineering first is your field trading and circuit emt okay see module 1 most important thing you should do compulsory okay whether it is vector analysis quadratic system gradient divergence curl laplacian divergence theorem stokes theorem all the things are necessary for you okay now just listen carefully the most important thing i am telling you right the level will be definitely easy okay easy not moderate also it will be easy for your nbc exam no need to worry in that the important thing is that you should know all the concept you should know all the formula you should know all the units okay these are the important things because you know that for this for diploma students are also eligible although they want experience but still right so they will just frame the questions to balance the degree diploma things right so module 1 is most important for you right in module 2 what we have electric magnetic fields okay so full module 2 that is from here to here that is electric magnetic field okay all the thing you can read obviously i will not waste time there so all the things are important for you okay third next subject now that is your circuit theory module 3 classification of circuits okay that is your linear time variant whatever okay that things sources and signals you know already what is the uh, basics of signals u of t del d okay then your uh, sources voltage source current source dependent independent standard signals again uh, source transformation technique you know network topology graph matrix graph theory just do uh, how to find number of trees from a graph that you should know okay formula you should know formulation and solution of circuit equation based on graph theory using different analysis technique that kevel kessel wala team but i will remind you just uh, to skip this topic okay don't need to do this cut set tie set just do one more okay cut set tie set more important and duality concept okay in the electrical resistance you know duality concept right so that table just uh, remember that table next network theorem and application most important full module you will do that is superposition then reciprocity thevenin norton maxim tron milman substitution compensation and telegraph theorem okay and there is of circuit subject to periodic and non periodic excitation using fourier series laplace so basically fourier series and laplace transform you will do concept of free and force response of circuit that is transient response you will do okay magnetic coupled circuit also you will do and analysis of circuit with dependent sources basic kevel kessel wala thing okay now for this thing from what source you to study or i can say you can practice okay so definitely gate one mark should be there with you and esc previous year at least last 10 years you should refer okay basically this whole module or i can say module 1 module 2 module 3 module up to module 5 is your emt plus network theory right so simplifying manner network theory plus emt so esc last 10 year paper and gate one mark are uh, compulsory for you if you want add on you already practice this thing then you can also add your ssc jes papers previous year paper last 10 year okay but this is add on this is compulsory the most important thing okay next the second uh, thing is your electronic devices and systems okay so in that what they given to you analog now in analog part if you see carefully module 1 transistor biasing circuits compulsory you will get question from this compulsory transistor biasing circuit okay ce 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 cb amplifiers all the things you should know okay you should know uh, self bias analysis you should know voltage divider base analysis so short questions right darlington amplifier probability is less but definitely you can do this basic thing just how to find current and everything right then h parameter and their application in analysis leave it no need to worry leave it okay class a b c d s power amplifiers just know the basics of class a b a b c d that is uh, what is their conduction angle okay then uh, what is your crossover distortion in which uh, class clock power amplifier clock crossover distortion exist okay which power amplifier we use to nullify the crossover distortion effect basic thing you should know okay. next is your push pull operation so leave this no need to worry in here jfet now if you study jfet before then you can do otherwise you can leave basic symbol just you can see the symbol and everything right but i will not uh, recommend you to do now but ha huh, a uh, current uh, drain current formula you can do right i ds is 1 minus uh, that formula you can do 1 minus vg is upon vp square that formula you can do gm formula also you can do transconductance right biasing of cs cd and cd amplifier so if you are comfortable in jfet definitely you can do biasing part also analysis part i will not think 
means according to me obviously i i don't think they i will ask you but still for safe side you can do otherwise you can skip also provided you already study jfet some months before or some years before right mosfet in mosfet you have depletion type inestimate type mosfet and their biasing now definitely mosfet uh, depletion type and inestimate type mosfet and their biasing so biasing technique you should do right more you are a drain current formula of mosfet compulsory they can ask you okay so bjt jfet mosfet all the analysis part you can do with basics of your symbol knowledge you are uh, this saturation region knowledge how to identify regions in bjt mosfet that also you should know compulsory okay next is most important thing that is opm so in opm basic question they can ask you basic if they want theoretical like what is the sleeve rate what is this uh, your input resistance ro basic tips okay differential amplifier and is dc ac analysis no need to worry here just skip this opm characteristics yes do non inverting inverting voltage and current feedback all the feedback topologies you should know okay voltage current voltage series all those things you should know compulsory power supply skip this no need to worry here oscillators and tri triple five yes okay just do this oscillator and triple five whatever types of oscillators are there in hartley what number of capacitors are used this question ask in hl there is an exam which happens in april okay then in clap call pit all those thing you can ask so little basics is required for this right next module is your logics gates and logic families so from analog we are transition to digital part now digital electronics definitely sure shot question from logic gate universal gate okay transistor is a switching element just leave this combination logic circuits are important all the circuits all the things okay what you are mention here till here right then sequential part of digital electronics flip flop bias table then you are all the uh, flip flops master slave flip flop race around condition in which flip flop race around condition occur in which not a synchronous synchronous basic difference what are types are there up down counter analysis okay shift registers so currently what is going on basically lots of question they are asking from shift register in each exam okay and the uh, question is from analysis part that is you are giving a uh, three clock pulse then what is the output of shift register okay uh, p uh, p so c pressure is there parallel in uh, your uh, serial out register is given so what is the output for application of three clock pulse two clock pulse so like this questions are asking recently frequently i can say so sure shot i can say for md cell so they can ask high probability of shift register okay so let's do this state transition leave no need to worry just cancel it down next is your a to d converters favorite topic of all all the examination for nmd cell so you can expect one question at least from here basic your resolution calculator or your output calculation from dac adc right then variable register network binary ladder a to d accuracy resolution basic basic things are there sample disk conversion leave this count method continuous a to d dual slope success loop okay so all this uh, basic types also you should have idea what is the conversion time of that okay then uh, advantage disadvantage application every basic idea you should have because they can frame theory question also what i told you the level will be easy only okay so this is the second part actually it is not a to division system so it seems it is clear that the one who frame the syllabus have does not have basic knowledge of electrical engineering and just he just copy paste from somewhere okay i it seems to me okay no need to worry in that so this is basically your analog and digital part right again get one mark plus es last 10 year you can do if you want no that's it up okay get one marks and you are easy that's enough i don't think for ssc je is required here from that you can cover up all the things right yes now next go to so till now you are network and signals and you are analog and data okay four subjects okay let's go to your machines very important yeah so now for if i come to electrical engineering for all the computer exams your machine power system increases their weightage okay they just increase the weightage for these subjects so definitely now you should have enough idea or i can say sufficient idea of whole syllabus of your machines your power system and so for some exam power electronics also they were asked but still i will not consider power electronics for now for mdc but definitely machines and systems will be there right so what you need to study first basic Model one here we have electrochemical energy conversion basic cell things is there okay then okay so just do this transformers sure shot question so no need to worry all the things which I mentioned here you have to do here right till this part 
now definitely transformer is most important so at least try to cover up all the things in basic manner okay whatever they mention here at least you should know basics of all that's it okay if there is formula then definitely you should know formula also right then dc machines in dc machine what you will study basically you are basic principle method of excitation okay of motor then armature winding is there dc generators are there then your commutator testing direct digital matter to dc machines dc motors are there right yes so here also you have to study all the things okay there is no option in that so dc machine also you can do here also gate one marks and your eac last 10 years are in the for electrical machine whatever syllabus they mention here that's enough no need to touch everything if you have any extra time then definitely you can refer ssc j previous year papers last 10 years okay add on compulsory is get one marks and easy last 10 years okay last 10 years means 222 back okay next is your measurement and instrumentation this is also a very important thing so in measurement what we have psychology of measurement what is the given here method of measurement measurement system calculation instrument system basics of error you know okay in this thing you need to do errors in measurement now here theory part is there in your classification of instrument then classification characteristics of instrument okay then methods of measurement so just go through the theory part uh, probability is there they can ask right then you are starting in analog measurement of electrical quantities that is electromagnetic thermometer okay short short questions they will ask from here that is from this to power factor okay lots of questions they can ask you so just be ready for that then measurement of parameters again here we have different method of measuring low medium high resistance inductance capacitance okay short short questions again from here probability is there definitely potentiometer just do potentiometer also and magnetic measurement to ballistic galvanometer flux meter determination of hydrogen loop and measurement of iron losses have just basic idea about this no need to go in very much depth but definitely the detailed knowledge of this part see here is required to you okay other things you can just do in basic manner if you didn't study in uh, few past then definitely you can skip this part this magnetic measurement okay if you studied already then you can revise the things no need to worry in there yeah so next is digital measurement of electrical quantities okay okay next part digital measurement of electrical quantities so here what we have concept of digital measurement okay you can do block diagram study of digital voltmeter basic block diagram is there okay just go through that frequency meter power analyzer harmonic analyzer electron multimeter so i hope you studied already cro short short question you will get from cro okay in that uh, current pattern also lots of questions are there in cro and frequency of cro questions are also there in uh, whatever exams you happen uh, last year five ten exam so that's why lisa is pattern okay then about block diagram you should know exact knowledge about your vertical plates okay then your horizontal plates what are there what is there in your whole CRO diagram from where electrons are emitted on the screen aquatic coating is where it is using all the basic information you should know okay so just pay proper attention on CRO probability is high they can ask you the question from here right okay then yes then calibration of AC voltmeter and AC ammeter yes this also you should do Measurement of form factor of rectifier, yes, this is also important. Measurement of phase difference, frequency of sinusoid AC voltage using CRO, you can also go through this, okay. It still syllabus is high, but still we have to do, we don't have any choice here, right. Okay, then measurement of duration by Kelvin, okay. So see, uh, whatever is there uh, in here, means whatever it is mentioned here, only that thing they mention again, be specific, okay. So just, you should know. How to measure this means analysis part is there now right so you can go through this if you want otherwise you can leave no need to worry but from here i will recommend to do this okay then second point third point then your measurement of rotation by kelvin double bridge okay then measurement of voltage current using dc potentiometer yes this also just go through this how to calculate basically a calculation part okay no need to worry here measurement of temperature by rtd leave it then study of frequency differential time counter leave it Measurement of dispersion are LVT. Just go through this LVT because I think they can ask you. Strain gauge based measurement transition and strain gauge based load cell. Okay. So just uh, leave this. No need to worry here. 
measurement of flow rate by anemometer leave this study of storage accelerator and determination of transient response of rsd so definitely this thing you will do in your network so no need to worry okay study uh, the diode clipping circuits so definitely clippers and clamper is most important topic because in the past exams also questions keep on asking from this topic so compulsory clipping and clamper okay this and obviously come under analog but they mention and their measurement what to do with these guys zener diode as a voltage regulator compulsory okay then common emitter common base already i told you so this is not the thing here what we did already in analog part okay that is analysis part of this so for here also for measurement and plus analog definitely get one marks and you are esc pos here class 10 year enough don't touch any single thing right okay again we have here network analysis synthesis so very unprofessional in unprofessional way they frame the syllabus okay it's very irritating actually network analysis and synthesis again here what they mention concept of generalized frequency circuit generation separation leave this just do fourier transform in series okay laplace and z transform two port network basic things all you should know right network functions leave no time for network function state space analysis you can do right then consider filtering and filter types this also you can do identify identify a filter their transform function just go through that okay high pass low pass and like that tpi passive leave this frequency transformation also leave this okay the interaction rc file okay no leave this synthesis part do this right so from here just do this part then you are power electronics okay first module is power electronics characteristics which in be of different solid state devices namely all this your families okay compulsory question from here so do module 1 completely in module 2 also do completely classification of rectifier phase control rectifier yes this also module 3 also important and module 4 also so basically for power electronics at least they mention proper syllabus right so yes power electronics you can do again get one marks and you are esc last 10 year enough if you want addition then ssc j previous year last 10 year you can do add on okay for power electronics <coughs> focus more on your theoretical portion right definitely numerical will be there like in a very less chance there of numericals okay then again they mention machines here So already we did machines. Okay, what I told you in the beginning at this in the up above uh, PDF file, I can say page number. Just do all the things, whatever there in syllabus in your machines. Just do all the things. Okay, so I will not uh, just go through this because you know already. Yes, power system. So model one is generation of electric power. Brief description of thermal, hydro, nuclear, and gas power plants. Very important. Okay, power plant. This thing is very important. now definitely in nmdc power system will play major role okay so just be careful in that model 2 transmission and distribution system okay definitely whole model 2 you will do model 3 also overhead transmission line types of connector line parameter whole distributing you will do overhead line insulator also the whole thing you will do then mechanical design of transmission line and traffic load curves and introduction to ehv and hvdc transmission just have a basic idea about this okay no need to go in detail rest of the module 5 module 6 obviously you need to do okay there is no option that again get one marks and here i will recommend instead of uh, ssc of uh, your esc you can go for ssc j last 10 year in power system specifically i am giving okay get one marks plus ssc j add on is esc in this case right okay next is your control so in control what we have introduction that is basic part is there then mathematical modeling is there signal flow graph and you are this okay servo motor synchronous obviously that thing you will do in your machines state variable model you will do okay feedback control system characteristics this also you will do your time domain and frequency domain status error everything basic basic things is there okay then rh criteria and iqs criteria root locus okay this leave these things design of feedback control system yes phase lag phase lag okay these are important Uh, body diagram also important and root locus is also important. Then how to observe controllability, observability. This also important. Then you can leave these things. Introduction to PID. I told you the theory part is important of PID. Your controllers and compensators, right? So yes, uh, get one marks and ESC is enough for this. No need to worry for here, right? Again, they mention I guess about machines here. So, again, here we have 
synchronous machine and everything okay so already we did this in power system so just leave this part symmetrical port analysis again in power system or uh, symmetrical faults okay again in power system so in power system whatever is mentioned okay we have standard syllabus all the things you should do compulsory what i told you for machines and power system everything is important they can give you any of the questions from any of the topics right next year load flow is there introduction bus classification nodal matrix yes it is important god said a newton raphson method okay it is important so just do this power system stability stability and stability limits steady state stability study okay this is thing you can leave no need to do this thing power control concept of load frequency control control uh, concept of voltage and reactive power control so you can also leave this thing right okay next topic is your microprocessor and controller so definitely i hope uh, that for for the exams okay if you are following me then lots of exams was there in which you already studied microcontroller so just revise okay those candidate who already give this exam where your microcontroller is there revise that portion okay now those candidate who didn't touch microcontroller no need to study here just leave it because obviously you don't have any option you can go with microprocessor compulsory because microprocessor is important okay and the uh, weightage of microprocessor also getting increased in day by day in the your technical exams that's why it is most important for obviously ec also and electrical and for computer science also right then your architecture is there 8085 8086 basics programming okay very much important a one program they can ask you so just go through that interfacing is there then you are a dma is there okay interfacing of d2 attd leave it the details of interfacing device leave is semiconductor device read only random access interfacing memory bit 085 basic idea about this you can do right then microcontroller is there in microcontroller so okay at least you do basic difference between processor and microcontroller okay that thing you can do it is easy there is no problem in that other things interrupt serial timer you can leave okay instruction program also you can do okay the next is your electric drives so what we have here introduction electric drives okay so basic thing you can do here the dynamics of electric drives fundamental torque equation speed torque yes this is also important full model 2 model 3 we have rating and heating of motor so this you can leave model 4 rectifier control dc drives control rectifier circuit one phase yes this is also important okay model 5 is a chopper control dc so about choppers right then your induction motor drives three phase ac and okay this thing you can do if you want cyclo control converters you can do otherwise all the things you can do no problem in that just do here cyclo control basic then synchronous motor drives vsi drives csi drives csi drive in load competition cyclo converters drive leave this breaking methods also you have various breaking of dc and ac just do this basic breaking mechanism important Regenerator breaking of DC motor in chopper control. Okay, you can leave this if you want. Interest of microprocessor control, leave this. Okay, so from module eight only basics of you are breaking AC DC motor. Next is computer aided analysis and design. Okay, so what we have here? At least have basic idea about this software. Okay, why P spice is used? Why uh, P C M is used? matlab simulation why matlab is there okay at least a basic idea other things directly leave do not touch okay then computer regression architecture so if you can leave this completely because obviously it is not for you guys right they just added for you also but still you can leave this okay so also skip this part then memory regression so you can skip don't do this okay then communication is there so if you studied communication for electronics exam then you can revise that portion those who didn't touch communication just leave because obviously time is very less no need to touch there okay see we should handle the things smartly what i told you in general we will focus more definitely in technical what we can study we are doing right but the extra thing because of time prior limit obviously we can't do okay so just leave this if you study then you can revise there is no problem in that okay then information technology means from a electrical engineer guy they want he should have he or she should have knowledge of electronics communication also computer science also and it also okay see then a radar satellite see leave this okay then also this you can leave this no need to waste time here basically information security i i want to meet this guy who framed the syllabus okay then your information security and privacy is there cryptography 
they want cryptography also artificial intelligence also leave this okay then dsp is there in dsp basically let's see what we have so obviously z transform you will do okay lt system you will do in signal we have that dft fft basics you will do right then uh, radix 4 algorithm leave this radix 2 god gel algorithm cheap algorithm circular convolution convolution have basic idea of convolution uh, circular and fast linear convolution right fr filter ir filter leave this no time design of data filters you can leave this time frequency analysis leave this no need they will not ask okay definitely z transform lti system analysis of lti in z domain right jury and guri just leave this everything sure cone leave this quadratic stability you should know how to identify uh, properties of your lti systems right then they want uh, database knowledge also from you okay so just leave this part Next is high voltage engineering. Okay, so <laughs> I can't control my laugh actually. Just leave this liquid diode. Leave this generation of high voltage current, generation of IDC impulse voltage, tripping of a control impulse generator. Okay, so few things we already did in measurement also. Okay, that is voltmeter and everything. Here we have do this. I will be testing of electric testing of insulator testing circuit breakers. Have a basic idea about circuit breaker testing. Okay, this is they can this may they can ask you. Then power transformers also you can do. Okay, other things just leave. Then we have EHV transmission corona labs need of EHV transmission. Have a basic idea about EHV transmission, right? Uh, then okay. Then next we have mechatronics. So again, uh, you can do from here into a mechanical system. Okay, leave this control system open loop, closed loop. You know already, right? This thing you can do sequential controller, macro based controller. You can leave this basis of real technology. Okay, do already we did in digital electronics. No need to worry, you plug and everything. Sensors and transducer already you did in measurement, right? Then uh, just leave this mechanical option, leave this. They also want your mechanical knowledge, also. Okay, means IT, CAC. Your EC and mechanical four branch plus your electrical branch means five branch knowledge they want from you in NMDC level and GOT level. Microprocessor, okay, introduction microprocessor. You already did this, right? Then again, machines written here. So, yes, it's clear that machines very important. Then high voltage engineering, okay. Here, what you can do. Okay, just leave this all. High voltage testing, testing, okay, leave this again. Okay, this is leave this okay computational intelligence also you can leave this then computer network so if you have basic idea about network okay then do otherwise you can just leave this advanced power electronics yeah this thing you to do okay advanced power electronics you can do and it is important for you so dc to dc converters okay then you are ac to dc converters already you know cyclo converters and that things then your classification of chopper, okay, everything you will do in your power electronics part, bug boost converter, all these are important, model 1, model 2 also. Then, materials in electrical and uh, system, yes, this also you should do, okay, this also you should do, so, so because basic uh, question they are asking in the frequent exams, that's why. So in that what you can do, basically magnetic material you can do, okay, basics of insulator, semiconductor and your conductor you can do. Components, register, capacitor, you have basic idea of that, right? Processes, basic process, like oxide sense, do this. Calculation of capacity, so you can use this. Okay, and then uh, materials, superconductive, superconductive material, this is also important. Then switch gear and drilling, basics of switch gear, circuit breaker, okay? Basic knowledge you should have. SFC circuit, uh, types of circuit breakers. If you studied for it, you are AEJ exam. So for this definitely SSCJ last uh, 10 year you can refer, okay? What is the type of uh, circuit breaker and protection against lighting? All these things you will get there. Insulation, vagara vagara, substations, static relays, okay? Then your utilization of electrical energy. This also you can do. Electric energy and electric transition. So for this also SSCJ last 10 year just refer that. Water syllabus is there, okay? They are asking question from electric heating also, which is most important than arcing, okay? Then attraction. All these things are important. Yes. 
Okay, so this is your syllabus for your electrical LTC geo geoty post. Okay. So now whatever things I told you here, just do that things at very basic level. Okay, no need to go in very much depth because definitely question will be like this only. Okay, whatever I mentioned, just to practice get one mark uh, ESC. Okay, for a particular uh, subject, just do that. Similar type of concept, similar type of questions, you will get in paper. No need to worry. Okay. Also pay proper attention on your general part, right? So general plus technical. If if uh, they ask you the basic things and from no one subject, then definitely out of sixty, you can score forty up above also. There's no problem. Okay. But if they ask the question from this uh, uh, extra subject also, then definitely it will be challenging for you guys, technical. So I will recommend you to just uh, start with your general part and then you can go to technical for NMDC part. This is the best strategy you can do, right? For electrical engineering. So in your exam hall also, start with general part compulsory. Okay. Give proper time to your uh, count reasoning because see, you need to compulsory attempt puzzle and DI. You can't skip that part. Okay, because of uh, there is uncertainty in technical portion. So whatever type uh, time you are le time is uh, you left there in your exam, you can just put it in your DI your puzzle like that. Okay, this thing I want from you. Again, you can also put it into uh, circular arrangement also because sometimes it may also take time. Right. So like this, attempt the paper with proper strategy. Definitely you can make it. Okay. Don't start with electrical engineering technical because definitely uh, extra subject will be there. Definitely you will face problem. Okay. So first with full energy, we will start with general part, then switch to technical and then whatever time is left, you can do the extra topics. Okay. Now there is no negative marking. So attempt all question. Do not forget to attempt all question as there is no negative marking. This also you should know. Okay. Paper is offline. So the best strategy, how you can attempt the paper, I will tell you. First go through all the general questions. Okay, you are starting from the other section. So 1 to 40, you will go. Okay. Just mark the answers in your question paper only. Don't touch the your answer sheet or I can see your OMR sheet. Don't touch it now. Right. Just go through 1 to 40 question. Then go to technical from 1 to 60 or I can say 41 to 100 questions. Right. 41 to 100. So after doing this round, this is the whole complete round. Okay. After doing this whole round, take your OMR sheet and start marking the circles. That's it. Okay. So like this you will do and then whatever subjects are, uh, I can say questions are left, definitely solve that, mark that, solve that, mark that. So like this you will do. Okay. So this is the best strategy to attempt the paper. If you have any query in doubt regarding electrical engine or electrical or your general part, your magazine books, anything, all the links you will get in the description. Okay. Or comment section. You can feel free to ask me. You can DM me on Instagram also. And after your exam, just don't forget to message me your score and your everyone. Okay. That is your expected attempt everything. Right. So all the best for you guys. Whatever I told you, just follow that. Definitely you will get the result. Lots of results uh, I am giving you. You can see that. Okay. The main thing is that your preparation, my strategy, the comparison is deadly. Right. So all the best for your NMDC GOT electrical paper. Yeah. So now we will start our discussion for mechanical engineering syllabus. Okay. Definitely for you guys also, they have added lots of irrelevant topics or subjects for your branch. Okay. How to handle those things? What are the high import, high weightage subjects for your MDC exam? We will focus on those things. Okay. Whatever guidance I will give you, just follow that for your technical part. For general section, I already told, tell you things. Okay. Maximum focus will be on our general section plus technical, whatever I tell, I am telling you. Because technical is unpredictable. That's why. In general, do not lose any marks. Try to at least do not lose any marks here. Okay. Okay. So first we will see what we have in mechanical engineering. So mechanism and machines. Okay. So this full module or I can say full subject you can skip because obviously there is no familiar things are there and we don't have extra time also. Okay. For to complete this. Just if you want then gyroscope basic you can do. They can ask you the one theory question. Okay. Gyroscopic laws. Effect of gyroscopic couple on automobiles and shipped aircraft. The basic things you can do here. Okay. Other rest of the things directly you can put it into option. Okay. If you want, then you can do uh, kinematics analysis also. Concept of vector analysis, vector velocity and acceleration, and so planar mechanism. This thing you can do. Other things directly you can skip. There is no problem in that. Right. Okay. The next is your CAD and computer graphics. So in this, what we will see, what they have mentioned here. So first is module one, 
in module one basically what we have introduction need to scope of CAD okay so definitely you do this fundamental of CAD computer graphics application area hardware software basic basic things you can do here okay then in module two two D geometrical transforms so if you want you can do otherwise directly you can skip this 3D object also if you want you can do otherwise skip okay I don't think they will ask this 3D geometric transformation finite element methods so from here you can do numerical method introduction error in number root finding bisection method neutral option curve fitting least square method this thing you can do okay then Newton differentiation also you can do then for spring system stickness matrix is also important eigenvalue problems also you can do okay and last year CAD CAM introduction overview so this model you can do model 6 other things just you can skip there is no problem in that then the next is your engineering workshop so in engineering workshop basically what is gears okay this thing you can do at least basic knowledge welding you can do compulsory for you okay then turning boiling so all this process are there this thing basic knowledge you want here okay so just do basics of things just theory part i can say then the next is you are design of machine elements okay so here also you will do uh, model one is your introduction to mechanical energy compulsory all the things are important for you from here okay second is your model two design procedure application of statically loaded machine elements so this also you can do okay fatigue introduction to fatigue strength introduction model okay this thing you can skip design procedure of application of dynamic loading machine elements shaft okay and these things also you can do so model one model two and model four from here these are machine elements okay you can skip whole model three then next is your primary manufacturing so in primary manufacturing let's see what they mentioned so basically manufacturing basic introduction you should know okay what is manufacturing example application etc then casting important for you okay in the turn no need to study history of casting and everything design okay classification of casting is important casting material is important so just do this sand mold casting okay then basic principles also you can do okay all these things as per runner risers advantage limitation top gate bottom gate okay no need to study this much things here obviously we don't have that much time to study okay then die casting casting defects also important right so in model 2 just uh, just focus on casting basically if you want then melting pouring solidification also there okay just you can get the basic idea of that then forming process in forming process what we have basically so principle okay classification of forming hot working cold working just do this then forging also you should know what is forging okay what are tools are there for forging then classification of the same application of high rolling cold rolling important then you are uh, basic principle requirement classification method of this okay you can just what is this wire drawing and extrusion i have a basic idea about this okay so definitely this much things you can do from here okay then sharing also sharing also very important here welding again very important so basically this is your manufacturing part okay which you already studied in mechanical engineering so yes this you can do solid state welding all the things regarding all the types classification application of welding sharing okay all the things you will do here from this now then again uh, for this practice question you can just get from sscj last 10 year previous paper you can use okay and eac also you can use eac previous year last year paper okay so this is the important thing for this part then our famous and favorite subject is your fm right so in fm basically what dimension let's see see now your fluid mechanics heat transfer all those important subjects for your mechanical okay because uh, in the recent exam also lots of questions are there framing from here so and obviously these are include this is the common subject which you study for all the competitive exam so in this try to cover each and every topic okay whatever concepts are there in fm heat transfer your applications of that just do that right so in model one we can see basic concept property of fluid okay then your definition distinct from the solid fluid all these things you will do here then fluid kinematics also you will do fluid dynamics also do okay so from that's why i told you to get some idea about kinematics okay so it will be help here then you are in compressible fluid flow then hydraulic turbines and hydraulic pumps so basically whole fluid mechanics you will do okay for practice get one mark and eac uh, last 10 year paper you can practice 
if you want add on practice then definitely you can go for ssc je last 10 year pre paper okay so this much you can practice for this fm the next is heat transfer important again so for what we have in module 1 basically introduction modes of mechanism of heat transfer basic law of heat transfer you can do right all the things are important here then one dimensional steady state complete heat transfer in homogeneous slabs this is also important okay then whole of the spire overall heat transfer coefficient electric energy one dimensional transient conduction heat transfer okay so chart solution of transient conduction system this thing you can leave then conventional heat transfer classification system based on cotton flow condition of flow configuration of flow okay just just have a look on this what are topics are there here just get the basic things then you have free conversion development of hydrodynamics thermal power boundary layer along a mitre vertical plate okay then heat transfer with a phase change boiling pool boiling free conversion development of hydro okay lots of addition add on things they actually actually give you and obviously that is not linked with heat transfer okay that is the problem so the one who framed the syllabus does not have single idea about mechanical energy it seems like that okay what we can do we will need to face this no need to need uh, no option in that heat transfer with phase change boiling okay just just get the basic idea of that because heat transfer is important so from this they, he can ask you anything okay in the exam that's why at least have basic idea of all the things that i mentioned here right the next is your control engineering part so here you can do the uh, modeling of your mechanical elements okay like mechanical uh, systems hydraulic systems also they can ask you this modeling you can say state equations like that okay block diagram single flow graph no need to do this transfer function okay obviously this is linked with your now uh, electric electronics so from a mechanical engineering guy they want knowledge of electrical also electronics also computer also okay how it is possible for that is also for jot post right then just skip this part skip this skip this everything just have basic idea about how your hydraulic system and mechanical system transfer function everything okay modeling part basically then you have integrated design and manufacturing so here just have basic idea about your uh, life cycle of mechanical equipment in design this thing they can ask you okay then a requirement of life cycle personal like customer okay this basic things are there no need to do this role of this also leave this leave this okay all the thing you can do i don't know who framed this syllabus actually machine tools and machining right so now here what we have classification of manufacturing process characteristics of material removal process need and uh, purpose of conventional material removal process so just have basic idea of this basic kinematic structure of single lathe hai kinematic analysis of this speed okay speed gear box feed gear box have also basic understanding of this they can ask you mechanism of chip formation also important so just study a little bit about this Okay, then in module four we have mechanism of machine identification of cutting forces, orthogonal plane, cutting force in turning milling. Okay, just do this cutting force in turning milling shaping, drilling. If you have to leave this, leave this, leave, 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 leave. Okay, then in module four, tool wear, tool life, and tool material is there. Here also you will get basic idea. Then introduction to grinding. okay grinding you will do okay this thing you will do other there is no sense to do this kinematic system operation turning machine planning and sorting you can do so basic kinematic system and operation of miling machines construction working principle this thing you will do okay so this just do this thing then the next part is your metrology part basically in metrology they also want you knowledge of metrology from you so in this what you can do precision accuracy method of estimating okay if you study this this much syllabus before also for mechanical because for few computer exams they ask this okay then you can revise the things otherwise no need to touch now from here what you can do basically two wire three wire methods as there okay they can use gear methodology you can do okay then uh, type of error measurement leave this leave this leave this non traditional and computer uh, manufacturing again cad is the cam there basics of cam you will do okay hmm. 
here at least have the basic idea of robotics right in esc basically you will get this uh, topic so just have that basic idea and you can just practice esc theory questions of that okay then also have cnc machine very important so have a basic idea of cnc machine also right okay this much is important then other things you can leave right okay the next chapter is your ic engine and refrigerator definitely important so they can ask you anything from this okay for amdc it is most important topic subject so let's see what basically they have in model 1 for us basic concept air standard cycle fuel cycle okay auto cycle diesel compulsory will do si engines also this thing you will do combustion spark engine okay this will you ci engine also you can do engine system components ignition you will do model 4 also model 5 also ic engines okay model 6 is you are a fuels and emission chemical structure of petroleum refining process of this okay if you want you can uh, just leave this if you already studied then you can do okay otherwise uh, model 6 you can uh, just leave for this then part b about refrigeration so what we have in that so bell coleman cycle brayton cycle okay obviously model 1 is important model 2 vapor compression refrigerator all those uh, things mentioned here just do this model 3 reference system component compressor general classification comparison okay condenser uh, okay just do this model 3 also model 4 vapor absorption refrigerator calculation of this other reference system vortex okay yes so full refrigeration you will do okay prefer sscj last 10 year previous refer for practice of refrigeration and then you can uh, refer esc also right then the ac part is there so let's see quickly what we have in ac introduction to psychopyometry property the process characteristics of this sensible okay okay so this thing you can do air condition system compared equipment cooling filter and okay so whole ac also you can do again sscj previous paper you can refer for this the next is most important subject for your mdc is your power plant engineering so lots of question you can expect from here right okay so let's we check what we have so steam cycle okay process heat power fuel transport there you can do this model 2 boiler also very important model 3 steam turbine model 4 plant component model 5 power plant economics and this okay so whole syllabus of power plant you will do just prefer your uh, gate one mark question eac also and if you want then ssc j also okay give priority to ssc j then eac if you want then gate one mark otherwise give no need to worry in that okay so this is your power plant engineering next environmental pollution and this okay so all these things we already studied but you can leave this model 4 have a basic idea about pollutants okay what is smoke smoke that basic thing you can do atmospheric lapse rate inversion and heat balance this thing also you need to do air sampling pollutant measurement method do this Okay, other things you can just leave then vibration and noise control so here also there is no sense to do this vibration noise control so okay if you can leave this if you study this in your engineering definitely you can revise but i know that lots of means i can say 19 percent candidate do not refer again engineering books so definitely you can leave this okay so every topic you can leave Then we have a computer graphics and solid modeling. So already we did this. Okay, CAD CAM again. It is there. So already we did this. Introduction to workstation. No need to do this thing. Okay, then thermodynamics there. Thermodynamics whole whatever syllabus is there in thermodynamics do that. Okay, very important. Principle of this. Okay, then your kinetic uh, theory of gases, velocity energy, transport energy. This is important. Phase transition. Okay, let's do this also. So thermodynamics is important. Tripology. So in tripology, what we have? Okay. So you can leave this whole. No sense to do this also. Then turbo machinery. Okay. This is important now. Okay. Steam turbine first. So whatever the things are there associated with steam turbine, gas turbine. Okay. Jet propulsion also important. Rotary compressor, hydraulic turbine. So in SSCG previous year you will get these things. Okay. So just practice question from that. No need to touch any other things for this steam uh, turbo machinery then your welding is there so again we studied welding 
and now here also you will again study welding okay important electric arc welding then basic basic idea just uh, do this okay the basic things we want here no need to go deeper here so in welding technology okay no need to do this uh, things weldability do then mechanical handling system equipments also no need to do this simulation of mechanical system applied electricity and plasticity okay so theory of electricity obviously do this very important theory of plasticity also important stress strain gauge everything is there so just go through that just go through this also stress strain relation okay stress strain rate equation then uh, in simulation of mechanical system what we have basically this thing just okay okay leave this okay leave this okay technology of surface coating is there if you have basic idea of a nano technology just go through that otherwise just you can skip that part okay otherwise erosion corrosion and so you can do basic things at least other things you can just leave okay then mechatronics so from esc you will get this mechatronics thing so mechatronics okay here you can do basic basic things are there few electronics concepts are also there obviously leave that microwaves are also leave that controller also leave that okay then electrical concept also they ask leave that so basically lots of irrelevant subjects are there that is no sense with mechanical engineering this is the portion of electrical electronics okay then you can view that theory of conservation emission you, okay this thing you can do combustion in si engine obviously you need to do this thing okay here you can practice your gate one mark your esc last 10 year paper you can practice for theory of this okay okay then combustion in ci engine model 3 whole model 3 important combustion gas turbine emission also important so whole this thing is important robotics question you will get from in your esc last 10 year paper you can practice for your edc or your robotics okay then sensor or actuator strain gauge you can do this control of manipulators robot programming no need to study this much detail have just basic idea of your esc 10 year paper whatever questions are there just practice that okay so this is whole syllabus of your mechanical engineering for your technical part okay now just listen carefully how will approach you how you how will you approach the paper first start with your general part because in technical lots of uncertainty there okay lots of extra things they added there definitely if they ask question from this extra part definitely it will uh, consume your time and it will you can waste end up investing your time there okay which we don't want so start with general part right just go to 1 to 40 questions of general now in general try to cover up all the things because what i told you in technical part there are lots of uncertainties right so we can cover up that marks in general only in this 40 questions okay because in this 60 we don't have any idea about your the uh, what are your things that so definitely general will play important role in your selection as your whole selection is dependent on your exam only right so just go to start with general part start with then technical part second priority you will go to technical okay exam is your offline okay it is omr based exam so what you will do just start with general start from 1 to 40 questions then you can start from your 41 to 100 question of technical whatever you can attempt quickly just do that okay and after doing this whole one round that is from 1 to 100 touch your omr sheet and start filling the circles okay do not touch omr sheet in between the general and in between means your this uh, flow because this flow is very important start from so 1 to 100 and then definitely you can just fill the omr sheet right so like this you will attempt the paper and then in the second round again you can start the question which you can again means you think you can do okay again just give more time to general in this paper because a syllabus for technical is uh, obviously unbreakable that's why okay and whatever topics i told whatever resources i told for technical just practice from that definitely the same uh, the copy paste version also you can you can get from that okay if you have any query and doubt regarding anything definitely you can comment down below for mechanical engineering 
so all the best and after your exam just don't forget to share your review and your attempt for expected cutoff video okay that is most important and for that just join our telegram channel okay in which you are getting all the updates also and telegram pdf and everything okay all the best okay now we will start with civil okay so obviously don't see their pdf because it is 20 page pdf lots of things are there to you to study okay simply what we will do now whatever your syllabus is there of your gate exam okay or i can say of esa exam uh, forget about gate just follow your esa exam syllabus for your civil engineering okay whatever topics are there just do that and obviously it is not worth to see this also okay i don't know who framed the syllabus of your nmdc that is also for junior post junior training post right just follow esa paper okay you can just uh, solve gut gate one marks plus your EAC last 10 year paper of the syllabus which is common for gate and EAC okay and add on things are there in your EAC syllabus just follow EAC previous paper okay now see what the important thing is there all around the main what we want basically we want selection right so all around the candidates will uh, be con confusion here what you will do first we will start with your general syllabus okay this is the specific strategy for your NMDC see whatever i told you in the non technical portion just follow this strictly because to score more here out of 40 is more important here because technical portion is unpredictable obviously no one can do this syllabus okay in whole engineering of your civil engineering you can't study this much thing so technical is unpredictable whatever topics or uh, question they will ask you from your eac you will answer them no problem in that okay other than that there is no guarantee that you will answer okay so first you will start with your general section out of 40 marks okay then you will start with your technical first is the uh, general second is your technical okay so this is your whole one round right so after seeing this one to hundred questions just get your omr sheet and start filling the circles okay so like this you will attempt your nmdc got paper do not touch technical first because obviously lots of uncertainty and there is no prediction there okay so it's better to just start with general and this okay in the smart way we need to crack the exam so no need to do all the things whatever is there in your eac you know already what is your high weight subject and everything right so just do that okay so this is the strategy for your civil branch if you have any query in doubt definitely you can comment down below or you can ask me on instagram also no need to worry in that again i am telling you just join our telegram channel okay and obviously lots of job updates you will get there along with your pdf solve that pdf daily pdf okay along with your box maxi box is there those who already have and add on is your technical eac okay this is just solve next batch is for mining so for mining also uh, syllabus is uh, good so you can do all syllabus okay there is no problem in that as uh, i can't uh, tell you more things about mining okay so for technical i hope you will handle the things okay main the how you will attempt now nmdc paper so first what you will do just start with your general part because general part is scoring okay and this will uh, this is definitely the deciding factor because obviously lots of candidate will, will struggle in your technical part in your mining portion okay so in exam first view prior to general part and please try to cover all the things whatever syllabus i mentioned for general whether it is aptitude whether it is reasoning and whether it is your uh, gk part okay because these 40 marks are very much important for you right and then second touch your technical part whatever uh, part you can uh, means you can do just do okay again for practice of technical part touch only get one mark questions no need to worry in uh, that just do this it is enough for you okay and just you can go to the exam and after doing this whole round of general and technical take your omr sheet and start filling the circle because exam is offline exam okay so like this you can just do that if you have any query or doubt regarding anything definitely you can comment down below or you can dm me on instagram don't forget to join our telegram channel which is most important for you to get further updates and further telegram pdf and everything okay all of okay so for survey also uh, syllabus is little actually if i compare with other branches so it definitely it is expected to do all the things here there is no high weightage there is no low weightage okay just three page syllabus is there so just go through the syllabus now the most important thing how you will attempt the paper okay see so what you can do if you are good with all the subjects okay definitely i hope you know the resources also if you know the resources then you can comment down below what resources you are using for survey okay so that it will also help to other candidates because i can't explain all the things in very much detail for this uh, branch that's well right 
but i know how you can crack this exam so just listen that carefully now start with your general section okay this 40 marks is very much important so at least try to score more here whatever sub uh, syllabus i told you for quant reasoning and your gk just do that carefully okay then you can go to your technical part and you will try to attempt maximum question that you are that you know in this out of this 60 okay so this is your whole one round after this one whole round take your omr sheet and start filling the circle don't start your filling the circle in between this okay because the complete flow from 1 to 100 is required for your first round this is your first round okay start your omr sheet and then in your second round you can just uh, start whatever questions you left okay just try to solve them and you can what you can do then side by side you can just uh, mark the questions mark the answers in your omr sheet okay at least uh, try to give time to your di and puzzle don't leave di and puzzle because that is the deciding factor of your exam okay also in gk lots of means of whatever you can do just do that okay if you have any query any doubt definitely you can comment down below or you can dm me on instagram also don't forget to join our telegram channel which is most important for you for pdfs and more exam updates also okay all the best okay for g and q cell so uh, whatever syllabus they mention you geological part definitely only two page syllabus is there just try to cover up the things okay now the most important thing how you will handle the paper that is most important thing so first is general part is there which having your 40 questions or 40 marks that is most important okay so whatever i syllabus i told in the first six, first part of the video just follow that right that will help you definitely to score more here whatever resources i told you just follow that right so in the exam start with general section then second you can start with your technical part whatever technical question they will ask you that is for 60 questions they will ask you okay so attempt try to attempt more question here also this is your whole complete one round after doing this take your omr sheet and then start the filling the circles okay so like this you will do then again the second round again you will uh, you can attempt the question which is left over in the first round and then side by side you can just fill out the circle also so this is the strategy to how to attempt your mdc paper okay just all the best for that and just tell me in the comment section that what resources you are reading or using for your gnqc syllabus okay so just join don't forget to join our telegram channel to never miss any job updates definitely and our your telegram pdf daily practice okay just do that continuously till you get selection definitely you will get selection lots of students are getting why don't you will get definitely you will get just dedication and consistency is most important okay all the best